Hey guys, it's Heather from Caliba Plan, and tonight I am unboxing a box that was sent to me from the Happy Planner. So I did receive this for free, but I'm so excited to show you guys. I haven't flipped through any of it yet, so you're going to be getting my like real reaction because I haven't seen it. But this is part of their new collection that they just came out with that's part of their Ready, Set, Goals line. Um, in this line, I think there's six or seven collections. There's Wellness, Fitness, Budget, um, Faith everyday foodie i want to say there's one more but maybe there's only six and i got sent one of the collections so i'm super excited to show it to you guys this is available now on the happy planner website and there are coupon codes that are good through thursday if you spend 75 dollars, you can use code save 15 and get 15 percent off if you spend a hundred dollars you can use code save 20 and get 20 percent off and if you spend 150 dollars you can use code save 25 and get 25 percent off and i'll put all that information in the description and they sent me are you ready to see what collection they sent me drum roll they sent me the budget collection i'm super excited to check this out and i also ordered today this is not part of the budget collection this is not supposed to be in there neither is this i thought i took everything out <laughs> um earlier today i also ordered myself the faith collection because i love it and i was not planning on ordering a new faith planner for 2020 but as soon as i saw the faith collection i knew i had to have it so i'm super excited about the faith collection i will film a flip through as soon as it arrives but for now, right now, we are going to go through the budget collection. So we're going to flip through it all. Let's, we'll do the stickers last. But here is the washi tape. So you get seven rolls of washi. This one says Bill Do. This has stripes. This has silver foil. This has black polka dots, but also colorful polka dots. This has little piggy banks. This says live well, spend well. And then this one is blue with some stars. So that's the washi tape that comes in this collection. Um, then we have a happy notes and oh my gosh, I am obsessed with these discs. They are a pale yellow. You guys know I love yellow. It's my favorite color. And I, this is a new color. They've never done a whole set of pale yellow. I think we've seen pale yellow like with the pastel sets, but that's with all the other colors. I'm like obsessed with this notebook just for that. So the cover of this Happy Notes says living that happy life. Um, and I'm, when you open it up, it's got rainbows on the inside and then polka dots on the back. I, it says, believe in yourself. You got this. Keep on dreaming. Stay rad, babe. You're super cool. And then it has lined paper with blue polka dots. The second divider says you are beautiful. And the last divider is a heart with rainbow. So nothing in this one is like necessarily part of the budget line. So maybe this is just a happy notes that they sent me. But I think it's part of this collection. But then it doesn't say budget on it. So I don't know. Maybe it's not part of the budget collection. It's cute regardless. And I love those yellow discs. Okay, so they sent me a mini budget pl planner. A classic budget planner. A budget companion pack. And then the stickers. So, I imagine the mini is the same as the classic, just a miniature size. So, I am going to flip through the classic planner. These are undated. These planners that come in these collections are undated. So, you can start using them whenever you want, which is kind of nice because if you don't want to start in January, you can start later. Um, it comes with some stickers to date your dividers. And it says, hello, this happy planner budget edition belongs to... You can letter your name there. On the currently page, we have budget for the month of, and you can write the month here. Financial goals, don't forget, it says keep track of events and unexpected expenses that pop up during the month, and then unexpected spend. So this is kind of like your goals and unexpected things that come up. The grass is green where you water it. That is so true. <laughs> Here is our monthly dashboard. Over here it says plan a happy life and it has a little dollar symbol. It is undated so you would need to date this yourself and it has the rainbows going across. Then we have, okay, I actually kind of love this. Do we not have the weeklies anymore? Oh my gosh. I'm so excited about this. In the past, the budget planner had the weekly pages. And I thought that was so silly because, like, I don't need a 
that kind of layout but it's not like that anymore and now i'm breaking out the mini because if it is like this in the mini i'm gonna be so excited and i may end up using the mini for a budget planner because it's easy to like throw in your purse oh my gosh it's the same oh my gosh okay i wasn't sure if i was gonna use this but i'm so using the mini for sure okay so we have date bill slash description category amount and paid i love this because i do something like this in my classic planner so i'm thinking i'll take this page and put it in my classic planner and i'll even take this page and put it in my classic planner for a savings tracker and paying off different accounts and debts it says no no spend try only to spend on necessities for at least one week during this month and then report back is there a different challenge every month Oh my gosh, there's a different challenge every month, you guys. Oh my gosh. Y'all, this budget planner is so much better than it used to be. Okay, weekly expenses. So we have different categories here. The date, the amount, was it a need or a want? What I think I'm going to do is instead of doing like these categories and descriptions, I think I'm going to use these, this in my mini and I'll probably cover these up with stickers. I honestly wish they had not put any categories here because I would like to fill that out myself. So I'll probably just put stickers here to cover it up. But I'm going to track just everything we spend on because this is like your entire amount for groceries. What if I go to the grocery store like three times? Or what if I eat out more than one time? I would rather be like grocery store, eat out, eat out, eat out, gas, like and just track all of our weekly expenses and write them out on here that's why i think i'm going to use this in my purse because it would be so good to just track it when i'm out and about i could put a little envelope or a little folder in here to keep up with um receipts i cannot wait i'm using this i cannot wait to i honestly was not that excited because i was like ah, i'm not gonna use this now i'm like i can't wait to use this okay so i am going to be using these pages in my classic planner and these pages, the weekly expenses um, in my mini on the go. And I will have like a whole video. I'll do a whole video where I set it up for January to like show you guys. But I'm like seriously pumped about this. And then I can just collect these extra pages that I'm not using in my classic and put them in a notebook and I can always use them later. Oh my gosh. Okay. So then we have like a page of graph paper and then it goes to the next month. Okay. Okay. So I'm just going to flip through the classic now because it's just like the mini, but I'm like super excited. So thinking positively isn't about expecting the best to happen every time, but accepting that whatever happens is the best thing for that moment. That's a really good quote too. Okay. And then, so here the monthly challenge is different. Here we have a hundred dollar challenge. Instead of an impromptu shopping trip, try saving $25 each week this month and you'll have yourself an extra $100 tucked away. I love those little challenges that they give every month. Sometimes you win, sometimes you learn. No cards, try not to use any of your credit cards for at least two weeks during the month. That would be hard for me because we put everything on our credit cards. We don't have debit cards or whatever, but maybe this month I will try using cash. Your future is super bright. Let's see what the challenge is. DIY, save some cash by making a few of your own household cleaning supplies. Okay, I trust the next chapter because I know the author. I actually really love that. Coffee at home. Skip the way to the coffee shop and brew coffee at home. Throw it in a cute, a super cute tumbler and hit the road. Look at that one. That one's got like some rainbow silver foil. This challenge of the month is no online shopping. Challenge yourself to nix the online shopping during the month. Your wallet will thank you later. Wow, that's a big one. That's a big one. It costs zero dollars to be grateful for what you already have. Bring your lunch, bring your own lunch, meal prep, meal prep, and get those lunches ready to go. You'll save an average $25 to $50 per week. Start where you are, use what you have, do what you can. Deposit every $5 bill that comes your way into your savings account this month. That's a good idea if you use cash a lot. Life is tough, but so are you. When you are out shopping, pause, reconsider your haul, and put one item back. Whew. Girls night. Let's do girls night in. Yes. See you soon. 
messaging your bestie. Family activity for a fun family weekend. Search your city's website for local spots to visit or activities that are free or low in cost. It's okay to make mistakes, to have a bad day, to do what's best for you. Reevaluate your monthly subscriptions to any services or magazines and cut those that are unnecessary. That's a good tip. Learn how to see the possibility, not the problem. Cash only for two weeks this month. Use only cash for any purchases other than your online bills. It will help you see how much money is actually being spent. And then the last page. Y'all. Okay. They did such a good job updating this budget planner. It is so much better. I'm like so pumped about it. I can't wait to use it. Now, these are the new companion packs that come that you could purchase. And this is the budget one. So it says girls just want to have fun and it's like a it's like an envelope folder thing. Comes with this bracelet that you wear to remind yourself of what you're doing. So this says wear this bracelet as a reminder to be intentional with your spending and conscious of where your money goes. And so then you just put that on your wrist and you wear it as a reminder. I actually love that. That's super cute. Okay. Then we have some note paper. Oh, these are this is not note paper. This is like cardstock. It's really thick. Motivation, you could put like your three goals. Savings jar. Oh my gosh, I love this. I use this for my tax savings every month. So like, there we go. It's ready to go in my planner. Goals, what is your short-term goal? What is your long-term goal? Saving for, what are four things that you're saving for? And what is the inspiration? And I love that these are like sturdier. They're like thicker cardstock. So they're gonna last all year. Then we have this very important folder. And then this is one of those dry erase boards. It has weekly expenses and your total, bills to pay, needs and wants, and then the back has a jot it down section. Okay, those are all very nice. I love all of those, and now it's making me think that maybe I do want to use the classic size budget planner because I really like all of those. Okay, okay, these, oh my gosh. These fit the classic size. Okay, guys, I have to use the classic size. I have to, because do you know what these are perfect for? These are perfect for cash budgeting. Oh my gosh. Small progress is still progress. If not now, then when? Know your worth. These are great for cash. Now I have all these ideas in my head, y'all. I cannot wait to set up a budget planner. I can't believe how excited I am right now. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I'm going to set up a budget planner and y'all are going to want to see that video because it is going to be so good. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, there's four? You get four? Y'all, this right here is why you should buy this companion pass. This right here, this companion book. Because these are game changers. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I have all these ideas on how I'm going to use it and I cannot wait. I cannot wait to show y'all because y'all are going to be so excited. Okay, get it, girl. Hashtag get it, girl. Financial goals for the year of, and then you have, you can write out your goals for next month, next quarter, next six months, and next year. Vision map. Where do you want to be in one year, two years, five years, and ten years? I love that. Bill schedule. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, you could plan out your bills. Two, four, six, eight, ten, for the whole freaking year. For the whole year. Oh my God. They thought of everything, y'all. If you were into budgeting, they thought of everything. Debt repayment. You put what your debt is, your interest rate, your beginning ba balance, your end of year balance. This is so good. Your savings trackers. For the month of don't spend. What are you not spending stuff on that month? And a habit tracker for it. Oh my gosh. Two, and again, you have one for every month of the year. Budget review. What was your income, your expenses, and your savings? And you have it all on one, y'all. They thought of everything. And then we have notes pages. Okay. I have so many things going through my head right now on how I'm actually going to use this. And I'm going to have the best budget ever in 2020. Oh my gosh. Seriously. Y'all have to come back for that video. I will get it up as soon as I can. Prepping my budget planner for 2020. It's going to happen. 
Okay, now we got to look at the good stuff, y'all. We haven't even looked at the stickers. We haven't even looked at them. Okay, let's get our X-Acto knife so that we can cut these stickers open. This is the mini pack. Don't give up what you want most for what you want now. Weekly spending. Bills due. I totally adulted. Little bills due with the little icons for your different bills. Life is tough, but so are you. Weekly spending. They're yellow. So it looks like the same stickers, but they just repeat in colors. So we now we have green. We had pink, yellow, green. Now we have blue. And purple. I need to find hobbies that don't include my debit card. That's hilarious. Okay, that's really cute. This is the accessory pack. So these are not, over here, these are not sticky notes. These are just notes. So you could tear them off and punch them or tape them in your planner or whatever. These say today, bill due, no spend challenge, and weekly spending. Okay, then we have saving stickers, paid stickers, shopping, groceries, phone, TV, internet. So these are, again, like bill stickers. Electric, gas, auto, gasoline, insurance, and debt, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Y'all, they thought of everything because there was exactly 12 for the whole year. So you have one book with enough stickers for the whole year. Thank you. Happy Planner. It's genius. Oh, my gosh. They have stickers so that you can budget for your planner supplies. Yes. Yes. Colorful boxes, reminder boxes, upcoming. Then we have little icons, gifts, birthdays, sports, kids, music, dates, movies, graduation, phone and computer, medical, medical, planner supplies, flight stickers. I love these. Food, uh, coffee, those are coffee. Water, trash, notes, rent due, taxes due, bills due, mortgage, rent, budget review, savings review, goals, and then some quotes. Oh my gosh. That is the accessory pack. And now we have the budget stickers. All right, budget. We got some quote stickers. Set a goal and when you're going to accomplish it by. Oh my gosh. That doesn't even have to be budget goals. That can just be like for 2020. What are your goals and when are you going to accomplish it by? Bills due. I need these like all the time in my planner. So good. Monthly goals and why. Why is it your goal? Knowing your why helps you to stick to it. More bill icons. You could put these in your monthly to track when bills are due. These have silver foil. Today, what was the amount and did you pay it? So that's a good way to remind you to pay bills. Those are really cute. I love that there's like every color. So no matter what spread you're doing, you have a color that will match. I love that. Coffee run, shopping trip, eating out. Repairs, emergency, medical. Movies, dinner out, brunch, family outing, entertainment. These are savings, so when you move money to savings and what your new balance is. Bill due stickers. Saving stickers. Y'all, these are so good. Bill due stickers. Bill due stickers. Budget review. I love these. I love to put these on the left side of my monthly. Six week savings challenge. What are you saving for? Your deposit, your balance, your deposit, your balance, your deposit. This is good for like go wild, a go wild saving, savings challenge. That's awesome. I love those. Weekly spending, like a summary of what you spent each day. Don't forget paid bill due. No spend challenge. Auto pay. Payday. Account balances, that's awesome. You could do that like at the end of every month. I 
thought there was another page. Oh my gosh, these are just dot stickers. Look at those bullet point stickers. All right, so that's the budget book, guys. Y'all, I am pleasantly surprised at how much I love this collection. I was not that excited about it. I'm not even going to lie. Because budgeting's not fun. And so it was like, oh, yay, I got budget. But like, <laughs> y'all, I'm like genuinely obsessed with it. And I like can't wait to set up my 2020 budget planner. I'm such a nerd. I can't wait. Okay. So thank you to the happy planner for sending me this. I cannot wait to set up my planner. Um, check out their website to order. If you want to purchase this in stores, it will be in stores. I'm not sure what store, but if you look on their website and scroll to the bottom of the item that you want, it will tell you what, what store it will be at. It will be at either Joann's or Michael's, maybe even both. I'm not sure, but check the listings on their website and they, it will tell you. I will link that in the description. So if you like this video, I hope you hit the like button. Come back soon to watch my, my budget setup video and happy planning.